Hi, I'm Peter Abraham from the Boston Globe and Boston.com and welcome to spring training today from sunny Fort Myers, Florida, home of the Red Sox Player Development Complex in JetBlue Park. Well, as we often see here at JetBlue Park, one of the first sights of the morning is Bobby Valentine coming in on his bicycle after working out in the morning. <laughs> Bobby V is a dedicated bike rider, that's what he does to keep in shape and oftentimes he'll come into the park really early, get on his bike, go out for about a 10 mile ride and then come back to the park. It's kind of emblematic of the enthusiasm Bobby V has brought to this job. When you're out watching the workouts, it seems like he's on all six fields at once, going place to place to place, getting his hands on all sorts of different players, wanting to see what's going on, and as he says, coaching the coaches, letting them know what he wants and having them pass it on to the players. Oh, Nothing wrong, yeah, but make it like you're going to catch it, right? Pat in your glove a little. Make it like you're going to call it. I've got it! Do it, Andrew. I got it, I got it. I got it, I got it. Nice. Oh, nice. Nothing wrong with that. I've enjoyed most of the time. Well, it's been a lot of time. But, the, you know, it's, it's still a, uh, for me, I'm still getting to know everyone, and that's my main chore. You know, it's not about enjoy, enjoyment right now, but it, it's, you know, it's easy to get up in the morning and go to work. Today was a day for the position players to go through their physicals, one of the training camp routines that everybody has to go through every season. But for the pitchers and catchers, it was just another normal day of workouts. Josh Beckett was among the pitchers who threw live batting practice. A large crowd of fans came around to watch Beckett throw to some minor leaguers. He pitched pretty well, kept the ball down, although one of the minor leaguers, a rookie league catcher named Zach Capstein from Rhode Island, did hit a home run off of Beckett. So a pretty good moment for that young man. Also, Chris Carpenter, newly arrived from the Chicago Cubs. The young right-hander was compensation for Theo Epstein. He's in camp now, wearing number 66, trying to get the lay of the land, figure out what the Red Sox want out of him. He said it was a little weird to think that he was traded for a general manager, but it's also kind of cool because he'll go down in history as one of those footnotes. And he has a big arm. He's a 95 to 100 mile an hour fastball, a guy who potentially could help the Red Sox. It's unclear at this point whether he'd start the season in the major leagues or down in Pawtucket, but this is the guy the Red Sox are going to take a look at. The other pitcher fans we're trying to get a look at today was Mark Melanson. He's the young man who they, got, they obtained from the Houston Astros for Jed Lowry. He's got a chance to be the setup guy for Andrew Bailey, and certainly a prominent member of the bullpen going into this season. I'm Peter Abraham for the Boston Globe and Boston.com. Thanks for watching Spring Training Today.